A Terengganu-born woman and her two children are the first batch of Malaysians rescued from the horrors of war-torn Syria. Inspector General of Police Tan Sri Muhammad Fuzi Harun said the family was rescued on October 6 with the assistance of the Counter-Terrorism Division and Turkish National Intelligence Organization. Sejak 2013 hingga Oktober 2018 ini, warga negara Malaysia atau warga kita yang berada di Syria berjumlah 102 orang. Satu dua orang. Satu dua orang. Daripada jumlah tersebut, eh, 37 telah atau korban atau meninggal dunia di Syria termasuk mereka yang menjadi mastermind yang turut terlibat eh, dengan Daesh di Syria dan Iraq. Dan daripada tiga, selain daripada 37 tersebut, 11 orang telah kembali ke tanah air. Muhammad Fuzi said this on Thursday and claimed the woman had been tricked into going to Syria in 2016 by her husband who wanted to join the Islamic State. He was killed in February in clashes with Syrian forces. Uh, saya lepas dapat tahu macam perjuangan yang kumpulan AIS ni salah. Lepas tu, saya fikir anak-anak juga Suami pun dah, dah memang dah tak ada, jadi saya teringat rindu juga mak, family semua, saya decide nak balik Malaysia. Saya harap um, tak ada uh, wanita ke anak-anak yang yang berhasrat nak pergi sebab kat sana memang agak susah. The police were made aware of the woman's situation after receiving information from her family members in Malaysia. The authorities will also assist the woman's two-year-old son in getting him a Malaysian citizenship. Meanwhile, Bukit Aman is also working to rescue another four adults and seven children in Syria.